Howdy folks, Terry here from Renegade Game Studios with your Renegade recap for February 2020. We're going to recap the whole month and while it was short, there's a lot going on. So if you can't keep up with my motor mouth, that's fine. Just hit the link in the video description and there's going to be a whole list of learn more links so you can keep up and catch up and uh, stay up to date with what's going on. Now, let's go. The first thing we're really excited to share is that Paladins of the West Kingdom has been nominated for a South by Southwest Gaming Award for Tabletop Game of the Year. We are so thrilled about it. We're so excited to be nominated again. And you can vote for this award. Just head over to this URL and uh, click the vote button. I swear it takes like two seconds. You can absolutely do it. Just go. Go now. You just pause this video. Go. Go. Next up, I'm really excited to share that we have had two products release in two friendly local game stores. Absolutely go and check them out. The first is Gloomy Graves. It is designed by Jeffrey D. Allers. It is a card laying game and it has probably some of the most spoopy, unique style, creepy, cute um, blend of art that is out there. So if you're interested in a really thinky, puzzly style card laying game that also has really unique art, this is definitely a game you want to check out. The second is an expansion to Eternal Chronicles of the Throne, and that is the Golden Steel expansion. Now, Eternal Chronicles of the Throne is a deck building game that, that is blended with a card battling game. If you're interested in that sort of card collecting type play, but aren't interested in blind boosters and aren't interested in, in trying to keep up with that chase, this is a perfect game to share. And it's also a great game to share with friends to introduce them to that kind of play. The Gold and Steel expansion brings markets, weapons, and double influence abilities into the game. So it's a really great way to expand play if you're a fan of it, or if you want to grab both the base game and this expansion, now's the perfect time to grab them up at your local game store. RPG fans, we are so excited to announce that the Wardlings campaign book is coming in May. This is a campaign book that is 5th edition compatible and it is designed by Elisa Teague. If you are at all familiar with the really popular WizKids miniatures line of Wardlings, this campaign book is set in that world and it lets you play as the most treasured adventurers, the children. Now in this setting, all the classes have access to magical abilities using magical mechanics that only the children can access in this world. While you're on these perilous epic adventures, you as a young adventurer are accompanied by an animal familiar who will protect you from grievous harm. The moment you're possibly going to fall to a fatal blow, your animal companion whisks you away only to awaken in your bed the next morning, one year older. Now because adventurers must be children in this world that takes away essentially your adventuring career it's a really interesting kind of just really beautiful world you can learn more about it on the renegade game studios website one last game that we announced is the search for planet x now real talk there is a planet out on the edge of our solar system that we are trying to find and discover we can't see it but scientists are pretty sure it's there. This game is based on that premise where you will take on the roles of scientists as you jump into this app-driven competitive logic game, surveying the night sky and attempting to deduce the location of Planet X. Designed by Ben Rossett and Matthew O'Malley, this is a game for you science fact. Fans. One last product, we did a stealth announcement of a pre-order for the Power Rangers Heroes of Grid Rangers Pack number one. If you pre-order it before March 4th by following the links on the Renegade Game Studios website, you'll be able to get a bonus mini as well as the pack. You can definitely learn a ton more. We've revealed a whole bunch of stuff, including doing a live stream tweet. On Monday, we'll also be playing with the pack, so be sure to tune in on Twitch for that. Now, February was the first month where we moved our free content supplement of Overlight to Friday release because we are doing free content Friday with our partners over at Hunters Entertainment. This is a really exciting thing for us because not only are we offering a free Seed of Bricket supplemental piece of content for that world, we're offering RPG supplemental content for many of our RPG games. So definitely check out that if you want to get some free content, if you want to check that out. We also released the Dark Horde scenario for Power Rangers Heroes of the Grid fans, so definitely head over to the Power Rangers Heroes of the Grid scenario page to get your hands on that. In terms of streams coming up this March, we are going to have Power Rangers on Mondays. We will have League Day for the North Sea Sega on Tuesdays, and we're going to have the Renegade Random Roll on Thursdays. 
replays and bonus content will be shared on YouTube. So make sure you subscribe to our YouTube channel as well and follow us on Twitch to get notified when we are live. That is February wrapped up for you renegades, but we're going to have a busy March. So make sure you follow us on social media to stay in the loop. You subscribe to our Renegade Society newsletter to keep getting notified when we have new things to announce. Follow us on Twitch, subscribe to us on YouTube, and don't forget to play your game. See you later, renegades.